So this is a quick demonstration of a new project uh, I'm doing called Remote Debug Gateway. And just to give you an overview of what this project is about, then then let's start by, by showing this diagram. So today we actually have like protocol adapters for each modern browser. So that means we can use a Chrome a tool like Chrome Dev Tools with IE, Safari, uh, uh, and Firefox. But what we kind of need now is something more than that. It's, it's a gateway that can orchestrate uh, the various connections. Uh, so that's basically what I built. It's on GitHub, it's called Remote Debug Gateway. Um, and essentially it's a gateway that allows you to connect one instance of, for example, Chrome DevTools to multiple browsers at, at once. And it, it also has a little plugin I've written uh, where you can do real-time re regression testing. So let me show how Remote Debug Gateway works. So I'm here in my terminal, and what I can do is that I can type rd-gateway, then the URL I want to open, and then the browsers I want the URL to be opened in. In this case, kenneth.io, and I want it to be opened in Opera and Chrome. So let me press enter. What the gateway does now is that it opens an instance of Opera with remote debugging enabled, and uh, another instance of Chrome with remote debugging enabled. So that's the two windows you see here. If I go back to my terminal window, what you now see is that the gateway has outputted a URL to an instance of Chrome DevTools. So if I copy paste this URL, like that, and I just hide this window, I can go back in Chrome. And if I paste this URL in here, what you will see is now an instance of Chrome DevTools that is connected to my gateway, that is then connected to both Chrome and Opera at the same time. So what you're seeing here is basically concurrent editing. So you can see I can take the header of my website here and I can go out and for example change the, uh, the color here. So basically we have concurrent e editing with Chrome DevTools. There's no like proprietary standards or anything involved here. Uh, it's simply just multiplexing of the Chrome DevTools connections. What we also can do so, if, for example, I can go to the uh, to the console and I can type an alert, say hello, and what you will see is that that's being invoked in all the browsers, which is pretty damn cool. So let me just show you the different browser windows again. Too many Chromes. Anyway, so I was also kind of thinking. So now I have like concurrent editing of of of. Uh, of my browsers. Um, but what about if you could take it to the next level? Um, and that's basically screencasting. So Chrome has like this really wonderful uh, uh, function to do screencasting for a mobile device, but you can actually also trick Chrome to do it on desktop. So screencasting in a world of two connected clients at the same time, what would that look like? So let's, if you click the button here, let me just maximize the window is that what I'm actually doing, what you're seeing here is visual regression testing. So what I'm asking, um, so basically what I'm doing here is that I'm asking Opera and Chrome to, to screencast each, then I receive the different screencasting frames, and then I use Resemble.js to actually calculate the difference. And what you're actually seeing here is that there is a difference between between the, the two browsers. First of all, there's some, something with the text. The text rendering is different for some weird reason. There's also something about in this area. So if I actually look at, at the different uh, browsers, I actually see that, that the, the button here is a bit tilted in, in Opera. So I might not have noticed that, but with Chrome DevTools, now I actually have a, a visual way of seeing these kind of things because it's now doing like real-time comparison of, uh, of the browsers, which is pretty damn cool. Um, anyway, this is just a quick demo of uh, Remote Debug Gateway. Check it out on GitHub. Thanks.